three-year-old saw that her baby brother had stopped breathing. Then doctors realized what was wrong. A three-year-old's world is one of wonderment, excitement, and one new discovery after another. As they learn about the world around them, though a preschool-aged child may appear unable to form rational thoughts. After all, they're still in the process of understanding how life works. However, a 2010 paper published in the peer-reviewed journal Psychological Science challenged this viewpoint. In contrast, it stated that even the youngest of children are very much in tune with emotions and beliefs of those around them. Perhaps even more surprisingly, the paper also revealed that children could point out when someone was acting abnormally. And seven years later, a three-year-old from Silsby, Texas would prove that paper right in her own incredible way. She somehow noticed that her baby brother was no longer breathing, a movement and sound so subtle that even an adult might miss it. By subsequently alerting the adults in her house, the young girl ensured that her brother received the medical attention that he needed. Doctors were then able to uncover the shocking reason he was fighting for air, and it was a condition not normally regarded as a huge risk to little ones. Autumn Kern's Facebook page is filled with images of her three children. The photos make one thing patently clear. She adores being a mom to her little ones, who she shares with her husband, Tex. And it seems as though her daughter, Jose Lynn, has learned a thing or two about parenting from her own mom and dad. Jose Lynn couldn't tear her eyes away from her baby brother, Kaysen. In fact, she was intrigued by the breath of new life in her family's home, constantly watching over him. And probably unknowingly, she mentally recorded his day-to-day -day behaviors long before the moment that he needed her help. That's how she was able to notice something unusual about his behavior. Just as the report in the Psychological Science Journal had indicated that children of her age do. When he was just two weeks old, Kaysen stopped breathing and Jose Lynn realized what had happened. She then ran to tell the grown-ups in the house. She came in and said Kaysen had stopped breathing, her grandmother Pam Chance later told KBMT, an ABC affiliate in Southeast Texas. It scares me to death, but Jose Lynn's terrifying observation also inspired her parents to spring into action. He was dying, Jose Lynn recalled. He couldn't breathe or anything. Her mom and dad picked up the baby and began to pat his back, hoping to dislodge whatever might have blocked his breathing. And to their huge relief of all concern, their quick thinking worked. He gasped for air, Jose Lynn's mother Autumn explained. It was clearly a moment that must have brought the whole family a great amount of happiness. If it wasn't for my daughter or my husband, our son wouldn't be here today, she added.